फिर रिकॉर्डिंग होगी There was always that just that bunch of people that was being loved yeah. by audiences. Now we all have been accepted, and they potentially see us as interesting actors. I feel like I'm a I'm a dub dub that. No. Watch me on. Kya baal hata do. Pressures. Um, Pressures. <laughs> what is it? Pressures. Hi Alia, hi Arjun, welcome to our show. Thank Hi, you. Arjun. You know you 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 said about how uh, you were like the last assistant on Kalhu Na Ho in Karan mm. Johar's film to actually bagging a Dharma film in the lead. How does that feel? So real. Yeah. Uh, not a lot of people know my first paycheck was a Dharma Productions paycheck mm -hmm. uh, signed by Yash Johar, uh, and so I have a I have a genuine emotional bond with the mm -hmm. production house and Karan. So for me, it was uh, in a very uh, strange way coming back home to where I started also in that way, and uh, I was really happy that they chose me for two states. Alia, did you ever think about uh, assisting a filmmaker or anything, or did you always want to make a royal entry like you did? I wanted to be an assistant after doing one film. <laughs> so after student, you wanted to? I didn't assistant. know. I didn't know about assistant director or all. I had no so you had clue. No concept yeah. whatsoever. I had no clue, but I feel I'd make a really good assistant. Really? Why? Why yeah, so? a really good assistant because Why? I'm very interested in like giving clap and like. Screaming silence and like making sure everything is in order and um, like I mean I don't during highway I used to look and check for light I mean I want to do everything I want to do everything in a film. Do you think you should make a good assistant, Arjun? You've been there and done that. I mean, I make a clumsy assistant, <laughs> but I make a good assistant. Yeah, I didn't want to say that she would be <laughs> tripping all over the place, but uh, she would be a massive distraction for any any person acting in front of the camera. There's such a beautiful assistant off That's camera. That's true. That's true. <laughs> That's true. <laughs> have, have, have both of you read the book? Two I states. Have. You I have? have? Yeah. No, you haven't. Yes, I so. read it. In fact, uh, much before I knew it was going to be made in, made into a film. Mm -hmm. During uh, while I was shooting for student. So what was the reaction when you when you read the book? I Did loved it. Right away. I loved the book, and yeah. I I I was absolutely in love with the characters and the story, and I I didn't know it was going to be made into a film, but I always had a feeling that it will make a very very good film. Mm -hmm. And uh, I never, in, you know, in the world thought that I would be playing Ananya character. Yeah. Ananya's character, yeah. Alia, are you much of a method actor? Do you like go deep into the role and analyze <coughs> it, or are you like just more spontaneous and just let it play out? No, I have no method. Yeah. Uh, no, There's no method to your madness. <laughs> no method to my madness. Yeah. Uh, but I, um, I mean, what happens with me is uh, after shooting. After doing one schedule, probably, uh, and getting little into the scene, then I get into the skin of the mm -hmm. character. I try to be like the character as much as I can, rather than getting my personal self into the character. Because mm -hmm. I mean, there's already a person created over there. There's right. no need for you to add another person. Mm -hmm. It becomes a big conundrum. Yeah. You have played all your movies till uh, till now. Very intense characters, be it Gundi or Aurangzeb. Correct. So when you're playing a very intense character, isn't it tougher to detach? And I mean, you have been a very intense character in Highway. So isn't it tougher when you're doing an intense character? It's very difficult. It and is, for me, right? At least I had a very hard time. And just your second film, I had a very hard time. Yeah, detaching from mm -hmm. highway. Also, it's uh, difficult to quantify and just call it intense. Uh, the thing is, that emotional journeys are different for every character that Absolutely. you portray. So, yeah. uh, in like, I wouldn't want to go into Parma was right. like this or yeah. this one, but yeah. they all have had different journeys. So. Like she was saying, you just invest in the character and just try and be honest to that. Yeah. Not mm -hmm. beyond that, you you don't uh, you can't think about whether it's difficult or easy. If there yeah. is an emotion, you try and be honest to it, right. so you'll feel it. You'll, you're, you're as a human being in that moment, the mm -hmm. anger eventually builds inside you mm -hmm. also. So when you're mm -hmm. doing a scene, you have to feel actual anger to be able to portray it. You have to feel that emotion, but that mm -hmm. does not mean that. I am going to be that angry the whole day. It is just in that moment you create an honest moment and then you disconnect from it. Earlier, somewhere you said that you know Arjun's confidence blew you away. Tell us about that. Did you? Did I? Yes, you did. You must have. Yeah, she's saying. Yeah. Zoom bolta to sachi hoga. I don't know Good where. One, Arjun. I don't know where. Do <laughs> you have? But I'm sure. I mean, do you feel that way? Even if you haven't said it, say for a minute you haven't. Oh. Uh, ah, I know where you said it. You said it in some magazine, magazine interview, interview. Uh, last year, but not this year. You, before Highway happened, you had said it. it was no, I said your performance blew me away. No, no, yeah. you had spoken about. I remember. I read it. I remember now. It was for you think, you know, he's film fair only. You. Was when you had done an interview. It is a film fair interview. <laughs> See, so much confidence. I can touch you. <laughs> so. <laughs> huh. I I don't mean confident in a in a very arrogant way, mm -hmm. uh, but he has this certain uh, ease. Uh, in, when he's in front of the camera, yeah. and even 
when he's saying his dialogues, uh, which something that I wish I had and I've actually learned a lot from, yeah. that he makes it his his own, you know, and he makes that he makes the place his own, which is something that I learned. You know, Alia's ex co-star uh, Randeep Hooda was saying that. Uh, maturity, yeah, <laughs> I so like how it's ex coaster. <laughs> she was in maturity. If we talk about maturity, she's way beyond her years. Do you is. think so? She is. Yeah. There's no two ways about mm -hmm. that. Uh, I think the beauty is that she doesn't carry it on her shoulders. Uh, she doesn't like to flaunt the fact that mm -hmm. she's been through her shares of ups and downs, and she's been through her share of upheavals and growing up. Uh, we all have our own struggle and yeah. journey in life. She doesn't flaunt it, but she's learnt a lot from it, and she's a very grounded soul because of that. So in this movie, you all have a live-in relationship, right? Mm. So would would you be open to this in real life? What do you yeah. think about it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. It's a. <laughs> I don't think it's very it's a, quick. No, I have because the that's question. that's the correct step to take for yeah. you to actually know if you can coexist in a hmm. personal. Uh, day-to-day -day environment before yeah, you come into a marriage. Huh. It doesn't have to be the length that Ananya and Krish have that's quite long. It becomes right, almost two right. years that they have a live-in relationship. You Why? can... Yeah, you, can no, you can feel ready in six months to maybe take the next step ahead if you're comfortable. Or you can continue living in a, a live-in hmm. relationship. Like, I, I really uh, am a full-on supporter of live-in relationships. Yeah. Ali, what about you? Yeah, yeah, me yeah. too. I think it's, it's, it's good, yeah, to, because you get to know the person, you get to know the lifestyle and basically, it should, you get should more be, time with yeah, each other yeah. also. I think that's yeah. essential also. Yeah. Yeah. If you're living in Especially separate Especially even our, our profession where you don't get time. Otherwise, right, exactly. something yeah. like that would be ideal. So you want yeah. to live in a relationship? Yeah. Not now. I mean, whenever I'd see this. When was she ready? But in our society, it's often a live-in relationship is often looked upon as something very casual. Like, you know, just for example, like every time there's a kiss in a movie, people make a very big deal about I kissing on screen. I don't think that's anymore. Yet. You don't no, think yeah. so? No, I yeah. think it's changing. I, like, I find it funny. I mean, Karan said that as a joke and, you know, that became such a big thing that there are uh, written articles about kiss hai to opening milegi. It's not such a big deal. Yeah, yeah. Kiss exactly, today. Exactly. I think the bad cam broke that about no. when was murder. The first one was yeah. the major breaker, ice breaker absolutely, of this. Absolutely. Which was yeah. when was the Malika Sharawat and Imran? It's been a good 12, yeah. 14 years now. A decade. Yeah, the first but murder. But I mean, I feel like it's ridiculous. Yeah, you're saying that you've never kissed in your life. Seriously. It's the most normal thing to do if you're people. in love. What is the first thing you do? There's physical intimacy, and that is portrayed in cinema now in the most mm -hmm. correct way rather than two flowers or you blurring the camera out. So yeah, we are being, well, you want to push the envelope, but you're going to cringe on kissing, that's not going to happen. Exactly. You say it the or open it. The idea is, and the thing is that actually happens in mm. India also. Living mm -hmm. relationships happen everywhere you everywhere, go. Everywhere, absolutely. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, Shuddh Desi was about that also, if I'm not yeah, mistaken. Yeah, exactly. That was the premise of the film, actually. And people yeah. actually went to see it because they were intrigued by the yeah, fact that this happened. That's why it is so well. There have been constant rumours about the two of you being linked and all of that. So how do Where? You, there have been. On Zoom, no? Nah. Not on Zoom, everywhere. <laughs> Come on. Yeah, Zoom on. Zoom. Everywhere. There is no reaction because... Uh, react. We are No, we are co-actors, we are friends. We've got along really mm. well. We shot this entire film together and mm. I consider her a very close friend of mine. In fact, I just said it in your colleague's interview that uh, the best part for me about two states that I'll take back with me is I've made two very close friends in the process of this film, Abhishek and Alia. So for me, I know what's important to me, what I've got out of it and what my re relationship and equation with her is. Beyond a point, you can't justify it. Speculation is normal. Uh, I mean, people gossip and discuss. Uh, so, as long as it's not derogatory, I always say that. Yeah, yeah it comes the territory. Yeah, yeah, you're prepared for it when you sign up for this profession. It, mm. It's all part and parcel. As long as they don't start hitting you below the belt. That's all I've always maintained mm. that. Talking about friendships, you're just saying that, you know, the competition in the industry is very fierce. My last time, Ranveer mm. and you yes. were talking about it. Yet you and Ranveer have this inseparable friendship. So much that he actually says he's envious of Alia. <laughs> yeah, he tweeted that. Yeah, he tweeted that, yeah. He's so, gunda ban gaya, Punjabi yeah, gunda. Yeah, exactly. I envy Alia, that's what he wrote. Yeah, yeah, yeah he's yeah. so cute. Yeah. He's mad. Yeah. Yeah, yeah I, guess I don't like to speak about it now anymore, yeah, because I genuinely wanted to stand the test of time. Mm -hmm. Equations and friendships in this profession can get soured for the yeah. smallest possible reasons. I'm mm -hmm. very fond of the guy. And yeah. I look forward to being able to work with him more in the future. Mm -hmm. And uh, I'm just uh, happy that I found yet another friend in this profession. So yeah. for anybody that ever looks out for reasons to say that we can all get along, I think uh, mm. we would like to serve as a decent example in recent times. Yes. Also, I think what's happened, which I, I don't know if Ranveer and me touched upon this last time, at least I believe a lot in this, is that whole uh, 
first sec first corner number one corner number two corner it has, you mean, yeah. yeah it's reduced quite a lot because that if so many people have been accepted by the audience that means there's room for mm. many people yeah earlier there were lesser people who were accepted so th there was always that just that bunch of people that was being loved yeah. by audiences now yeah. we all have been accepted and they mm. potentially see us as interesting actors as different personalities so that race is no more the only essence of right. our being Yeah. Only focus of what yeah, you are the, the idea yeah. is to keep doing good work for a long period of time and see where you stand. Maybe sustain. after about ten years, right. yeah. to sustain basically. So yeah. for it becomes easier to coexist when you when you're looking at sustaining and not jumping over somebody. Else. Yeah, right. I mean, what's the point if you're number one for one year and then you just disappear? Yeah. It's very temporary. Yeah. Yeah, I mean, it should be sustained. But you know, every chat interview, in a, in every interview or a chat show, you know, whenever you ask people that. Who's the next promising person? There's always the two names come up as Ali and Parniti. When people say these things, there's a lot of pressure on you. What do you feel? Pressure is um. Pressure. Is... <laughs> <laughs> What? <laughs> What? It didn't sound like that. What did it sound like? <laughs> pressure is. <laughs> it pierced through my left ear, came out from my right ear, and left. It's going towards that camera right now as we speak. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Pressure is it. there no matter what. I yeah. feel. Uh, uh, I feel that there is going to be a point where people either will 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 worship you or they'll bring you down. Mm -hmm. You know, you can have a great year. You can have two great films and have one bad film, and then suddenly you're the worst person alive. Matter, yeah. So I feel like none of these things should get to you. But I have pressure from my own side. I give myself pressure because mm -hmm. I constantly want to be. Bettering myself, I constantly want to get better. You know, the last interview we were talking with Arjun and we were talk, we were speaking about how in this day and age it's very difficult to get that kind kind of mad crazy fan following that the Khans had or something like mm. that because the entire focus and the meaning of stardom has changed. Correct. And I remember you also saying, you know, you want you're here to be an actor and a star. Mm. So what do you think about that? No, uh, today only we were talking about. In fact, Arjun yeah. said something very nice was that now actors uh, and people have become more attainable. A star earlier was what that you know somebody who you could not see. Yeah. Uh, some, like worship, not, yeah, worship. exactly. Star का मतलब ही होता है ना star. कभी-कभी ज़मीन पे आता है. वो होता था genuinely. So exactly. that when you were to see a Shah Rukh Khan or a Salman Khan or an Amir Khan anywhere, it would be like a rare sighting, once in a blue moon. Mm. You know, probably if you are lucky. Now it's literally on Twitter every day. You're tweeting, okay, so I'm going to be in this mall. Right. I'm yeah. going to every city to meet them. You know, so now it's like we're friends. <laughs> What's up? You know, which is nice. Which is in nice. A, it's a way. different. It's yeah. a different energy. And I feel like uh, probably now it's become more personal. You know mm. that um, you have shows about day-to-day -day basis. You know these shows where sh that, sh that that talk about the star exactly what we're eating, what we're not Look, eating, all of that. Only thing yeah. left is uh, nobody sees us going to the bathroom. That's pretty much the only the thing left. Rest is all covered, rest right? Rest is all covered. But it's it. I guess with time, changing times, even the value and the term stardom changes. And I think Salman Bhai is a very good example. He's mm. been a star through hits and flops. And He's today, so many ups and downs. Yeah, yeah. so. Salman Bhai is a fantastic example. Whether you look at Shah Rukh also, it yeah. just takes one film for people to be reminded of your stardom again. But mm -hmm. work is what matters at the end of the day. Nothing right. else. Right. But you know, I want to ask you both of you this: You're like young and new. It's great when people like your movies and you have fans. But there are also certain section people who criticize you. Mm -hmm. How do you deal with that? You have to use it to your advantage. Yeah, you have to. You have to. Um, Uh, I I read a really I saw a really good interview with of Deepika's mm -hmm. some article where sh somebody had written something about her and she put that up and underlined all her bad points wow. and look at her where she is today okay. I mean even if that wasn't true you don't you use you use criticism you know uh, in the best possible way mm. and i i love criticism come my way it makes me so much stronger as a mm. person and both of you industry kids so it's not like life has been easier for you all as compared it's, to anybody see, else see everybody's right? life has a journey at the end of the day let's not even get into our life we are not right. coming here to discuss our life we are coming here to be actors and do our work our life gets discussed we don't all, trace, it yeah. gets discussed yeah. you know <laughs> we are not saying ki hamari zindagi ki wajah se hum pe aap taras kha ke humko pasand kar the only time i react and i feel sad is yeah. when on the basis of my surname or my equation With my family, uh, you start using that to judge my acting. But do people really do that? Of I'm course, it happens. Yeah? Unfortunately, it happens. See, um, my father's production comes from a time, a uh, very long time ago, and yeah. now there's there was a time where they would make certain kinds of films that yeah. people probably would look down upon, or for whatever reason, I have no idea. Hmm. But that would they would inflict on me that just. 
Somebody read something, just use her in the, those type of films. That's all she's good for. Kidding me, really? But what do you mean by those type of films? Yeah, I mean, that, like, you know, well, you who are you? Those films only, no? yeah. Exactly. That's why they're doing exactly. that. People just behave like prudes, thinking yeah. that, oh, we don't do those type yeah. of things. And we don't, uh, so yeah, we don't them, know what you're showing yeah, us so on screen. It's, it's a bit of... That's derogatory. That's outright me. And yeah. Some, yeah, I mean, yeah. like... See, you, you, you must have an opinion. I respect yeah. people having an opinion yeah. is better than not having yeah. one. But have a rational, yeah. logical opinion about something. So, Ali, do you plan to go to the theatres and watch Two States to see the direct be audience mobbed. reaction? No, I, of course I would plan to go. I went mm -hmm. for student, I went for highway and I will oh, you went for student too? Students. Yeah. So, what are the funniest, uh, the coolest reaction you got from the audience? Student, I, I was sitting in Chandan and I heard in whistles Chandan? in when my bikini scene came. <laughs> I was happy. <laughs> we went for Gunde and Zoom found us. No, what was the audience reaction? We went reaction? to Chandan yeah. and Zoom found us outside, Radhveer and me. The reaction was unprecedented. Yeah, highway, I, I saw teary-eyed people coming up and like being very silent near I me. I was more sober as a reaction. No, but that was the reaction what I needed. Exactly. I didn't want people coming up chirpy. <laughs> <Please. laughs> that would be a very bad Yeah, I know, exactly. Yeah. Gunde was mind-blowing because primarily because uh, they reacted in our introduction. Yeah, they were whistling for yeah, us and all. Yeah, that, and you've done that for other actors. So yeah. you're like, boss, this actually means that they don't mind whistling for us. That's a yeah. very big deal. Like, I, I used to be blushing like how Alia blushes when I say nice things about her. <laughs> like, now she's going to start blushing. <laughs> yeah, I was like this. <laughs> so, tell me one, what, what is the best moment of two states? One memory you've taken home with you? Or of many, I'm sure. The moment I would take back is getting to go to Dharma's office as an actor. Wow, that's nice. That would be a moment that matters a lot to me. It yeah. was something that I silently had hoped that I would achieve on my own. Mm -hmm. Not because of whose son I am and that happened. I think um, at the end of the, f uh, at the end of the shoot, at the last, at the end of the film, last day of shoot, we were shooting um, India Gate and we were on a ferry India back. India Gate, no, Alia. India Gate only. In Delhi. Gateway of India, sorry. Shooting Gateway of India. <laughs> it's the same thing, yeah, Gateway of India. I've just called you mature, woman, <laughs> sorted. Gateway of India is the same thing. No. <laughs> You're making it worse. Continue. It's very easily mixable. And um, Arjun uh, typed a status. Hmm. And I was like getting very emotional. I didn't want to cry. So he typed a status and he showed it to me. What was the status say? Four outdoors, three people, two states, one love. So that basically summed yeah, it up yeah. for me. And I, and I didn't want to cry and then I started crying. I mean, <laughs> I, I wish I could not say only three people because it was 300 of us that made that film possible. Yeah, but, but the idea was... The bonding of us three genuinely was something, unprecedented. Yeah, yeah. Something special, thankfully. Wish you put super, super luck with this one. And thank, thank you. you so much, Arjun and Alia, for being on our show.